appearances. Uh, this is Nick Mosby running for office, and Nick Mosby is on my witness list. We talking about corruption. Well, Nick Mosby and Marilyn Mosby in the middle of it, one way or the other. He got to testify and, and submit the evidence I gave him. Jane Miller, too. Mosby is facing two other candidates, city council members Leon Pinkett and Shannon Sneed. Today is the first day of public impeachment inquiry. All right. The House Judiciary Committee will go over the House Intelligence Committee's report and what today's hearings mean. For the impeachment, I'm giving this to Donald Trump. Donald Trump asked for a federal investigation about crime and justice in Baltimore. This is corruption in Baltimore, all right? That's President Trump. Y'all trying to impeach President Trump? I'm giving them this is a whistleblower's application. President Obama had it. President Bush had it. Now it's going to President Trump. It's about Congressman coming seat in the Democratic Party. It's about Marilyn Mosby in the prison industry. Because Marilyn Mosby had this since 2014. It's about your prison industry and how you how you how corrupt your justice system is. That's 2010. That's nine years. Yeah, November 3rd, 2010. Baltimore City Police came in my house and put guns to my head. You feel me? They came in my house and put guns to my head. I took you to court and I beat you in court. When I beat you in court, you took my property. And this is the property that you took. The entire contents of the defendant's vehicle, a 1999 Chevy Suburban, Maryland. Registration. You took that from me. That's my property. So for the last nine years, I've been building this book. It's called I Am Dred Scott. And it deals with your prison industry. It not only deals with your prison industry, it deals with your war on drugs. All right? It deals with your war on drugs because Schellenberger used this case against me to get it an indictment. I was innocent of these charges. Schellenberger used this case. Baltimore Sun used this case. Adam May spoke about this case. That means that we're going to talk about this case in 2020. Governor O'Malley, Congressman Cummings, Senator Cardins, Mikulski, Richard McFeely of the FBI, Judge Bell, Judge Pearson, Judge Turnbull, Judge Boris, Governor Quinn, Eric Holder, CBS Gail King, and Bank of America, because we're going to talk about your money. We're going to talk about your money in the prison industry and the money that you get for black bodies in America. You feel me? We're going to talk about the money that you get for black bodies in America. And I'm going to name the people involved. I'm going to out y'all. Remember that stop snitching video? It's just like that stop snitching video, except I'm going to put y'all's names on it. Patricia Cook from Bank of America. Karen Parks from Fox 45. Paul Weinblatt from Weinblatt and Associates. Scott Schellenberger, Sheriff Fisher, Judge Turnbull. This is how you structure your criminal enterprise. C. Kai Jackson and Adam May. I put this toilet out in front of I put this toilet in front of the school board. See the names and the mail receipts? I put your political faces and your political careers out there. Yeah. That's Antonio Freeman from the Green Bay Packers, ask Antonio the parties I did for him. This is Governor O'Malley and his mom machine. Cases in this. She's going to have to toss a lot of about Baltimore County when she was running for office. Do you know about it? Nick Mosby, Marilyn Mosby, and I'm going to break your machine down. Yeah, Mosby got cases too. The White Pettit, Warren Brown, Billy Murphy, J. Wendell Gordon. Y'all contribute to most of these campaigns because y'all get, yeah, we're going to talk about the money behind the machine. We're going to talk about the judges. Like I said, I'm a, I'm a, I'm better than the average bear, boo-boo. I work for y'all. Never bite the hand that feeds you. So I'm building a toilet. Yeah. Slave labor. You seen Spike Lee last night. I might check the room. Yeah. Mic check. Yeah. We talking about right here. I don't want no misunderstandings. That's Governor Hogan. That's Governor Larry Hogan. Let me see if I can get you. That's Governor Larry Hogan because he got this. Y'all make a lot of money off of black bodies. 
the school of cradle pop pipeline. Y'all locking up our babies before we even be born. Like I said, this is a very intellectual toilet. And you can go to the Department of Justice right now. Yeah, go to the Department of Justice and get this. Because I don't want nobody to miss this. That's John Hopkins University. Yeah. We're going to open the lid. We're going to talk about mass incarceration in the prison industry. I'm gonna... He going to be my dog in 2020. Because we're going to fight against the Democratic Party. Enemy of my enemy going to be my friend. You heard of 48 Powers of Law? Well, we're going to talk about China and their trade industry and our prison industry. Baltimore. Yeah, see that? We're going to highlight the corruption. Racism don't work without black cooperation. You feel me? It don't work without black cooperation. Speaker of the House has my whistleblower's application. Telebranch has a lot of emails that's going to expose the, how long y'all been shielding this. The Maryland Black Caucus. We're going to talk about the money that y'all make off the prison industry. Not just them guards that y'all got jammed up, but the policies and the laws that y'all write to keep them in, 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 in prop and to keep it going. Baltimore. Spike Lee came here the other day. Spike Lee came here yesterday. I might check the room and everything. Everybody seen me there. Everybody know me in Baltimore. Can you handle this? I want to know if you can handle this. Because if you can't handle it, you can go to Mosby and get this. Because like I said, Mosby done had this for two years. Long before y'all did them investigations. Go to the city solicit Go to the inspector general today and get my case file. Can you handle this? If Mosby is sincere about what she's talking about and she don't want to go to jail. Everything that the inspector general got, she going to have to act on. So is Nick Mosby. Before he run for office, because he's sitting in the seat now. He got a job to do. Do your job or lose your job. You're going to be a defendant or you're going to be a witness. That's Justin Fenton. See the date? Wednesday, July 31st. Congressman Cummings corruption. Yeah. We're going to talk about it. Let's us not forget the 13th Amendment. Yeah, the 13th Amendment what locks us up. The 13th Amendment makes us slaves again. You feel me? That's Congressman Cummings' office. I had a meeting with him on the 13th of August. All right? So everything that Congressman Cummings got... Everything that President Obama got... I'm going to go to President Trump. Everything that President Trump got, and give it to Spike Lee so we can do the right thing. You feel me? Like you said, you want to talk about the orange man? Well, here's your chance to talk about the orange man. We're going to clean this shit up 2020. That's the big shit. That's the little shit. It's a holiday celebration. I'm the king of talking shit, and I can back it up. Might check that one.